Yamaha RX V2500 and I'm going to fix the fan circuit in it. Uh, something to do with the the main main board inside there. I'm getting ready to take it apart. Well, it's a little bit taken apart. And I'm going to fix it. Okay, this is the board. And the components that are bothering me. Okay, this is the board, the main board. And these are the two components that are causing me the trouble. That resistor there. Whoa. That resistor there is supposed to be 180 ohms. Um, one side of the Schottky diode is supposed to read 29.8 volts. And the other side 5.6. They are both um, showing 34 volts, and that's from the, uh, let's see, the other one, um, I think it's in there, oh, where would it be, oh, anyway, I'm going to check, check them out, check them, and then we'll see. That fixes the problem with the fan circuit and everything, so the fan will work. Okay, we get it all back together, except for the lid. Um, I'm just checking the, the voltages on it. I got the uh, and everything working. I got some of the tested. And I was testing it before and there's a little strange thing going on. So when I go to check the fan, fan test low. I got this hooked up here to uh, check the fan, the voltage and everything. And it should be on low should be spinning but it's not and the voltage is about two volts to almost three volts which won't spin that fan so I don't know then you go to medium and it turns and it's about five volts it's about six volts that it's getting. Okay. I'm going to put it in high. It's going faster. And that was only, let's see, 8 volts, 8.5 volts, 8.7 volts to be exact. Because it's getting. So that's no wonder that the fan is quiet. Anyway, it's all working now. Thanks for watching.